Hey everyone, Steve Kim here, so excited. Steve Kim Show episode number 44. The March stats are in and I'm here to give you the up-to-date numbers as they pertain to the detached and townhome markets in the 416 and 905. So let's get right into the numbers. So in Toronto, detached homes from February up until March. In February, they were trading around 1.296 million. Fast forward into March, that average detached home in Toronto is now trading at $1.268 million. Taking a look at Richmond Hill, back in February 2019, the average detached home in Richmond Hill was trading around $1.32 million. And fast forward into March, we now see that home creep up just a little bit for detached homes in Richmond Hill, now trading around $1.37 million. Let's take a look at Markham. In Markham, back in February 2019, that average detached home was trading around $1.235 million. Fast forward into March, we see a little bit of a drop getting just under to 1.2 million for March 2019. Taking a look at over in Vaughan, February 2019, that average detached home trading just over 1.24 million. Now fast forwarding into March, we see a little bit of a drop again, around $1.17 million for that average detached home in Vaughan. Months of inventory, this is all supply and demand. So in the 416, for detached homes, we see months of inventory go from 2.8 in February, drop just a little bit to 2.6 in March. Taking a look at Richmond Hill, pretty, pretty static, right? 5.3 uh, in February to 5.3 in March. So, you know, this is, this is the balanced market. Don't forget, back in January, December, we were almost pushing 10 months of inventory uh, for detached homes in Richmond Hill. Taking a look at Markham, we go from 4.9 months of inventory in February, and we see a drop to 3.1 months of inventory. So starting to get into a seller's market, right? And then in Vaughan, we go from 5.2 months of inventory, and we see a drop as well, 3.9 months of inventory. So this is really a telling sign that a lot of the buyers, they're now starting to purchase those detached homes because they are more affordable, right? So townhomes, as it pertains to the 416 and 905, let's see what they were trading for from February 2019 to March 2019. So in Toronto, that average townhome, Home was trading just over 967,000 in February. Fast forward into March, that average town home is trading now just over 942,000. Taking a look at Richmond Hill, back in February, the average town home was trading just over 797,000. And now in March, we see a bump up, right, to just over $827,000 in Richmond Hill. Taking a look at Markham, we were at just over 770,000 in February. And now in March, we see a little bit of an increase as well to just over $795,000. And then again in Vaughan, we also see an increase from February, just over 801,000 for that average townhome. Moving into March, we see that increase to just over $815,000. So you may say, Steve, how come we're seeing kind of in the 905, the increase um, of average sales price for townhomes? Well, really at the end of the day, these are, this is the next affordable option outside of condo ownership. So we were seeing a lot of buyers, you know, the semi-detached and the townhomes, they are going really, really wet, really quickly because they're priced at an attractive price point for anyone who's looking to get out of a condo but still can't afford a detached. So they're moving into the townhomes. Months of inventory, this is important for townhomes, right? So in the 416, we went from 1.8 months of inventory to now March 2019, 1.3. So absolutely getting into an, a seller's market. And if you've uh, been looking to buy a townhome in the 416, certain pockets you're now starting to see 8 10 12 16 offers i know of an agent who had a property in the 416 they had 22 offers on their property so absolutely we're starting to see those bidding wards come back richmond hill we went from 3.1 months of inventory down to 2.9 months of inventory um, from february to march and then in markham we went from 4.9 months of inventory to 2.7 so a drop so really starting to get into that seller's market for townhomes in Markham. And then again in Vaughan, we went from 3.6 months of inventory. We see a drop as well to 2.4 months of inventory. So the 905 York region for townhomes, we are all sub three months of inventory. So really starting to push into that seller's market. Anyways, I hope you found these stats useful. If you have any questions whatsoever, please feel free to give me a call, send me a text, shoot me an email, or come by and say hello. As always, be great, be kind, everyone. Take care. Bye-bye.